for someone in the next one minute I want to pray father in the name of Jesus the son of the living God the one who died and resurrected in power and glory thank you for the power to heal the power to bring life even to the sick you gave us this noble instruction to heal the sick while we preach the kingdom and Lord in honor and obedience to that call I stretch my hands right now over your people spread across this auditorium and its environs outside the many who are following online and the many who will hear this I'm praying in the name of Jesus that every spirit that is responsible for infirmity every spirit responsible for sickness diseases of any and all kinds by the power that raised Christ from the dead I cause the operation of those spirits from your body this moment in the name of Jesus right now I stretch my hands be healed shout a believing amen. amen headaches be healed right now eye conditions be healed right now heart conditions be healed right now blood conditions be healed right now bone conditions be healed right now organ failures let there be a brand new a reproduction of new organs in the name of Jesus respiratory problems be healed now tumors and cancers be cursed now fibroids we curse you now gastrointestinal problems be healed now reproductory problems be healed now urinary problems be healed now respiratory problems be healed now digestive problems be healed now neurological problems be healed now in the name of Jesus Christ back pain be healed lumbar spondylosis be healed joint pains be healed we change genotypes right now from SS to AA from AS to AA in the name of Jesus Christ ear conditions be healed now every prolonged pain in your body be healed in the name of Jesus now whether I mention your case or not anyone appointed to death by sickness those following from hospitals clinics everywhere be healed right now I stretch my hands and I declare let the healing power of Jesus from this ground through the airwaves let it flow to you right now I speak to someone you shall not die your health will not deteriorate it is cancer that will die it is HIV that will die it is tuberculosis that will die it is pile that will die in the name of Jesus every mental health situation right here in Nigeria across Europe America Canada Asia be healed right now autism be healed right now if you are here you came with a wheelchair you came with a crutch or some walking aid for your feet your hands I declare be healed right now for every and any infirmity here at this miracle service we pronounce you healed we pronounce you whole we pronounce you perfected in the name of Jesus you will search for that pain and not find it again you will search for that infirmity and not find it again I declare restoration to your health now rise up please stretch your hands towards this request stretch your hands please towards this request are there any requests yet to come please stretch your hands and begin to make faith declarations in one minute these Egyptians I see today I will see them no more forever someone full of faith is praying in the name of Jesus I'm going to bow my knees in one minute and lay my hands over these requests as a point of contact while you pray make faith declarations that in the name of Jesus Christ this comes to an end every oppression go ahead
In name of Jesus, I decree and declare over you, bowing my knees to the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, that every testimony that needs to come out from this request, beginning from tonight, may you begin to hear them. Amen. Beginning from tonight, may you begin to receive them. Amen. Every human agent who must partner with prophecy to make for the manifestation of this request, I decree and declare, may the Lord raise them and bring them to you. Every death sentence here represented is cancelled. Every issue of debt, financial issues plaguing people, it comes to an end permanently. Whatever it is that you've written here as an expectation that is consistent with the will of God, I release my faith with you even on this altar and I declare return rejoicing with your testimonies. In the name of Jesus Christ. Prophetically, I stand upon this request. And I decree and declare that these Egyptians you see today, you will see them no more forever. No more forever. No more forever. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now, I want you to lift your hands as I speak over you. Prophecy is the final or the second to the last atmosphere that is created for reception. Father, I decree and declare over your people, shame and reproach from this day comes to an end forever. Comes to an end forever. I decree and declare, wherever the helpers of your destiny are, whether they are in Abuja, in Lagos, in the north, the south, east, west, Europe, America, far west, wherever they are between now and the end of the month the month is not ended yet i gravitate them towards your destiny every long-standing issue you have prayed you have fasted it has refused to change i release my faith with you and i declare this is the season of change for you in the name of jesus christ may the lord give you a new song you will sing a new song. You will sing a new song. You will sing a new song. For someone, God will take away sleep from your helpers like Ahasuerus and make them open the book of remembrance towards you. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Whoever must come into your life for your rising, wherever they are, may they come speedily. Everywhere your job is, may God locate you and take you there. Everywhere your finance is for this season, can I pray against the spirit of debt and borrowing? In the name of Jesus, anyone who is in a financial situation now, I give you one month by prophecy. May the God of all grace bring you out of it now. Every family that has not risen, you have not seen the hand of God, the testimony of God helping men. From your father to your mother to your siblings to you, every one of you in concert receives strange testimonies. In the mighty name of Jesus, the gift that the Lord has put within you, I stir it up by the anointing and I declare may it bring you profiting. May it bring you profiting. 
May it bring you profit in. May it bring you profit in. What you have been looking for, I command it to start looking for you. Ah, 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 hear this one. What you have been looking for, may it start looking for you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Every confusion in your life, may the spirit of grace bring clarity to your life now. Everyone who is discouraged and downcast, you are wondering what will become of your life. I want to speak to you. In the name of Jesus, you will have the last laugh in this life. Anyone under the sound of my voice appointed unto death, I declare may death pass over you. May death pass over you. You are blessed in the city. You are blessed in the country. You are blessed in Abuja. Blessed in Lagos. Blessed in America. Blessed in UK. All over Europe. All over Africa. Return as a sign and a wonder. Return as a testament of God's favor. In the name of Jesus. Let me take a minute and speak over all who have sown seeds, giving, standing with us. I just felt stirred in my heart to do that. People give. The things that you see us do, it is based on the givings, the faithful givings of God's people. And I just felt stirred tonight to pray over everyone who has given, not just here in Nigeria, but across the globe, UK, America, Canada, people have given for our meetings coming. People have given even in the house. People have sown into my life as a man of God. I stretch my hands. God is not a fraudster. God is not a scammer. He doesn't play games with people. In the name that is above all names, you have sown to this ground. It is good ground. Therefore, receive a hundredfold harvest. Therefore, receive a hundredfold harvest. A harvest of prosperity. A harvest of wisdom. A harvest of helpers. A harvest of joy. A harvest of help. In the name of Jesus. May you never do anything alone in your life. God will raise people to stand with you. To stand by you. To stand for you. In the name of Jesus. Water to shame, may God raise help us for you. Now, let me speak over your spiritual life. Everything attacking your prayer life, attacking your word study life, attacking your zeal and your passion for spiritual things, it dies permanently right now. May your prayer life be fanned back to flames. May your word study life be fanned back to flames. May your passion for the house of God be fanned back to flames. May your appetite for spiritual things be fanned back to flames. In the name of Jesus Christ. Listen, I call you Beulah and Hephzibah. Beulah and Hephzibah. You are like a well-watered garden. I call you a wealthy place. An oasis springing possibilities. In the name of Jesus. You will not beg and you will not borrow. Yet you will not lack. In the name of Jesus. These hands that are lifted remain lifted forever. They will not go down. The Lord is your shepherd. He will guide you in paths of righteousness. He restores your soul. In the name of Jesus. Your enemies will not see your back. Your enemies will not see your face. Their plans will end as vanity. But as for you, the Lord is your lifter. He will lift your head. He will give you speed. No delay. No retrogression. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Advance. Progress. In destiny. And I pray for you. The kind of honor and favor you have never seen. This week. May God bring this as a witness to your life. Wave your hands to Jesus. Give him all the praise. Wave your hands to the King of Kings. Hallelujah. Amen and amen.